Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, in this video, I am going to show you the changes and improvements in the cumulative update of the release preview channel of Windows 11, version 24H2, build 26100.3037, KB5050094. So, without further ado, let's begin. This update improves the previews that show when your cursor hovers over apps on the taskbar. The update also enhances their animations. An icon will appear in the system tray when you use an app that supports Windows Studio effects. This only occurs on a device that has a neural processing unit. You can select the icon to open the Studio effects page in quick settings. To view the app that is using the camera, hover over the icon for a tooltip. This update adds Simpson a new simplified Chinese font. It includes the Biang Biang Noodles character. Some apps might not be able to display these new extension characters yet. The font has 9753 ideographs that support Unicode extensions, G, H, and I. You can change time zones in the settings app. Then time and language. And click on date and time. You don't have to be an admin to make this change. There are some fixes in this update like, after you do a search, that search might repeat when you don't want it to. Fix the date and time properties of a file, that might update after you copy it. Fix the icons on the details pane which might not update. As you expect when you change a theme, this makes it hard to view the change when you switch between dark and light themes. Fix the search box that might lose input focus as you type. Fix the snipping tool screenshots that might be distorted, this occurs when you use two or more monitors that have different display scaling. When you switch app windows, the email language might change from Chinese to English. Fix the issue where a device might fail to join a domain. The mouse cursor might disappear, this occurs when you hover over text fields in certain applications. If you turn on pointer trails, the mouse cursor becomes transparent, and a black box appears behind it. The mouse cursor might stutter when it moves across the screen, this occurs even when the system is not using a lot of resources. Fix the issue where you open certain files, like you open Excel, but the screen might remain on the loading screen. Fix the issue where a watchdog timeout error might occur when your PC resumes from sleep. Fix the issue where cumulative updates might not install, with the error code, 0 by 800736 b 3 this occurs after a feature on demand fails to install. Fix the issue where the display of some games appears oversaturated. This occurs when you use Auto HDR. When you right click items in the left pane, the new folder command appears on the context menu. This update removes the 1 minute timeout when you use a passkey on a phone. Fix the taskbar that took too long to close after you close the app. This update adds to the list of drivers that are at risk for bring your own vulnerable driver attacks. Fix the leaks that occur when predictive input ideas show. Fix the issue where you get errors, or cannot sign in, when you connect to Windows 11 workstations. This occurs when you enforce device redirection. You might experience issues with USB audio devices. This is more likely when you use a DAC audio driver. Based on USB 1.0, USB audio devices might stop working, which stops playback. There are some known issues in this update like Microsoft is working on an issue where players on ARM devices cannot download and play Roblox via the Microsoft Store on Windows. Some users report that the open SSH service fails to start, preventing connections. The service fails with no detailed logging, and manual intervention is required to run the process. This issue is affecting both enterprise, IoT, and education customers. With a limited number of devices impacted, Microsoft is investigating whether users of Home or Pro editions of Windows are affected. So, that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.